Hello. Hi. Could you please introduce yourself? Um, my name is uh, Kim Yong Il from Korea, uh, South Korea. How long you visit Phuket? How many times? Uh, I was first trip uh, in 2004, maybe uh, 2003 or 2004 something. What are you doing here? Um, I'm just doing my uh, wakeboard, wakeboarding camp. Uh, I just teaching and coaching. Yeah. How you decide to make wakeboarding camp and why? Uh, I was busy uh, 2004. The time is no obstacle, just nothing. Yeah, just people do uh, air trick. I was amazing. Like wow, people fly, <laughs> you know. So I just try. Like first day, I try rarely, and <laughs> you know. <laughs> like many times fall and I just keep doing doing and then I finally I made it and then I addicted and yeah. you have a lot of friends with whom you are working because you are not only do wakeboarding camp you are very good operator you know what to show to the people the best tricks. Please tell me about your wakeboarding friends around the world. Oh yeah, um, one of my funniest friends, like from Spanish, uh, Spain, is named Montana. Yeah, he's always keep smiling and always laughing. He loves wakeboarding, wake skating. Yeah, so just be riding every day. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah. <laughs> How long you stay on the water per day? How um, many hours? Uh, usually 30 minutes to one hour. And before in background, do you have any competition experience? Oh uh, yeah, I was many competition. I started competition at um, yeah, 2001. The first, my uh, international competition is, I think, South Africa. <laughs> South Africa? Yeah. Wow. It was, um, I'm a beginner. It was beginner. Yeah, I started like 2000 something. I just, good experience. Yeah. How many uh, years and how many countries you visited? So you travel a lot. For how many years you are traveling? Uh, for traveling about like almost 15 or 18 years, <laughs> something. And now you are traveling with your family. Yeah, now uh, with my wife and my baby. <laughs> okay, tell the story about your baby because as I know, your baby is the future wakeboarder. Um, maybe she, she will like, <laughs> I will teach. <laughs> yes, because she stay all the time on the side. What is her name? Ah, her name is uh, Summer. And so how old Summer is she? Summer Kim. 18 months really. <laughs> so 18 months baby stay on the cable almost all day during three months? Yeah. Okay, so see how growing up the new generation. And also please tell me a little bit about your camp. How many people during these three months uh, learning wakeboarding in your camp? Uh, about every month, four to five people just riding every day. Like they, uh, some, some stay one week, some stay two weeks, three weeks, one month, yeah, something like that. What is the goal? Why they come for wakeboarding to Thailand? They just love uh, wakeboarding and oceans especially uh, this place is in like middle of uh, in Phuket so very close to the sea seaside and shopping mall and a lot of uh, like activity so they love the uh, Phuket Wake Park <laughs> and Phuket Wake Park loves you because you spent a lot of time in our park and um, you are even in our brochure, your face, right? And we would like to ask you about drawings because before oh, your, yeah, your, yeah, yeah. 
your um, friends and, and one you... of my friends they really famous in Korea uh, for the graphic artist yeah they love the graph uh, drawing so I invite him and then they just draw on the wall <laughs> yeah and please tell me the story about operating because you do very nice filming filming of famous pro riders and you do that for just good feeling you never charge money you just do that for fun and yeah, how I, this happened um yeah i just like filming i'm not a professional filmer but i just love to yeah film like every almost every day because i want to show like some people riding really su super good but nobody film so i don't want to miss that so they just like focus like <laughs> Why wakeboarding? Um, I love water. Like, yeah, I don't know. I just, I, I, I just love the wakeboarding. <laughs> and previously, before, do you had any sport activities? Uh, before, um, I'm snowboarding. Yeah. So you're good in two divisions, right? In uh, snowboarding and wakeboarding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see, so sport is in your blood. I think the next generation, your daughter will be love also the water and snowing uh, for are, sure. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, please tell me a little bit about your summer because well, winter you spent here for three months and what are you doing on summer? Uh, in summertime, uh, I got my uh, wakeboarding school. Where? Uh, especially um, behind the boat. Uh, in near near Seoul, like one hour from Seoul, yeah. Driving or flying? Uh, try. And uh, this is the sea or what destination? Please tell me a little bit about your home city. Uh, I don't understand. About your city, please tell me. Ah, uh, my my city is a really small town. Um, around just mountain and then long river. That's it. <laughs> so guys, if you want to have extremely nice experience, please feel free to contact with you via Instagram, right? Yeah. Or Instagram, via email. Easy. Yeah. Instagram is easy. Yeah. It, all the information is in, on my Instagram. So. And not only Korean can visit uh, your place, right? Yes, and yes. enjoy it. So yes. what we can do in your city, please tell me. Uh, my city... Uh, what is the name? Ah, uh, Kapyeong. Mm -hmm. Kapyeong. So, Kapyeong or Chongpyeong. <laughs> if we come to you, uh, we can do wakeboarding, we can do uh, mountain climbing, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So like you that. can meet and take care about our riders uh, and there. And then it's always pretty close, like uh, my place to actually 40, 40 minutes, yeah, if you know, uh, not traffic. It's no traffic. Thank you so much and thank you for your camps and to join us. And guys, if you want to meet uh, this amazing coach, please feel free to contact with us or directly with uh, Kim in Instagram. Thank you very much. <laughs> thank you.